Let's start this up. Let's start it up. There's so much going on. Paycheck deposits into Coinbase. I learned about this last week. I heard it first from a AMTV. Then I'm going to show you information about the SEC lawsuit. It's smoking hot. John Deaton is, he's going to prove, he's going to prove that the retail investor have every right to get ahead. It's going to prove that XRP and Ripple shouldn't be a target to not flourish. Blockchain domains and layer two blockchain. Here we go. I will include this link in the description below. I just listened to this interview twice. Digital Perspectives actually recorded this interview and it gives you an indication that the cries have been heard and that there was a lot of dishonesty going on behind the scenes to prevent alternative cryptos, alternative coins, and to prevent Ripple and XRP to become the bridge currency of the world. Here we go. I will include this link in the description below. Listen to it. I'm going to read something to you. This is one of the many articles, and I learned about it through my Fidelity account, but this was up. Coinbase will let United States Coinbase will let United States users deposit any percentage of their paychecks directly into their accounts in the coming weeks. That's incredible. Now, I learned about this last week, but I wanted everything to sink in, and I'm multitasking. Deposits can either be in U.S. dollars or immediately transferred into cryptocurrencies with no fees. The move comes as Coinbase faces increased criticism from regulators over digital assets. I'll read a little bit more. Cryptocurrency exchange Coinbase is going deeper into traditional financial services, allowing users to deposit paychecks directly into their online accounts. Coinbase said Monday that its U.S. customers will be able to use the direct deposit service for any percentage of their paycheck. They can hold their money in dollars or immediately transfer it into cryptocurrencies like Bitcoin with no fees. That's going to be very appealing to someone like me. With direct deposits, customers can more easily access our crypto-first financial services and be ready for any trade or purchase. Max Brandsberg, Vice President of Product at Coinbase, said in a blog post, We've determined to deliver the most, we're determined to deliver the most trusted full suite of crypto first financial services to our 68 million users. The launch will go, the launch which goes live in the coming weeks. That's incredible. I had to read it over and over again to understand that. Comes after customers complained that frequent transfers from their bank accounts to Coinbase are time-consuming and inconvenient. Yes, it is, the company said. Coinbase added that it aims to give instant access to the crypto economy. Of course they will. That's their specialty. Did you think this wasn't coming? Did, did you think this wasn't going to come to fruition? Of course this was going to happen. It was just a matter of time. I've been following it. I'm sorry that keeps popping up, but I, I can't worry about it. It's protecting my identity online. Um, here's something else I want to discuss. This is, this is huge. This is major. Don't miss out. If you want to join Coinbase, visit the link in the description below. This is the time. You're never going to have this opportunity again. And I suggest you visit the link below in the description and listen to this interview. I listened to it twice, and my heart just started racing. What a way to end the day. Incredible. I'm going to speak about unstoppable domains, which are blockchain domains. I'm waiting for level two, level, 
I'm waiting for layer two blockchain to come out, layer two. And it's because all of these names that you see claim with ETH, claim with ETH, claim with ETH, I, I'll get them for free. I'll be able to claim them for free. And I was in touch with Unstoppable Domains today, <laughs> like a do dozen times in a chat, and I learned a lot. And um, another thing that I learned, I might as well show you as an example. I'll give you one example. All right, where is it? I have a lot of names here. I, I own over $5,000 worth of blockchain domains, and half of them are brand name blockchain domains. We'll, so we'll say um, Tarot Reed. I believe Tarot Reed. And what I'm waiting for is, for some reason, I didn't add the addresses into a couple of them because I want to sell them on OpenSea. And they charge you a little bit of a fee if you add your, I was going to add my Coinbase crypto wallet addresses so people can buy the domains from me. Some of the domains I want to sell. And as an example, um, like birth sign and tarot art, I'm going to click on here on open C. There's somebody that favored it. They're watching it. So I haven't had it up for sale in a while. And that's when I learned I only had a couple of, um, domains. Oh, come on. I just want this to open. I have to shut this off now for a moment because it's not going to open. Sorry. It's taking a moment. I'll refresh it. See one favorite right there? And I checked on that person. And they're very active on OpenSea. And they're watching to see about the price of this domain. This a blockchain domain. And I'm really happy about that because nobody's ever favored the domains I own. And that tells me they're interested. So I put it up for sale for one ETH. So I'm hoping that I sell it. Yes, OpenSea takes a percentage, 2.5%, I believe. That's okay. I'm, I'm doing it to learn it, to go with the motions. And I set it up. I'm hoping that they, they nibble and they buy it. This world is changing. It's changing fast. Oops. Don't miss out on the opportunity. Oh, that's an ad. I'm sorry. <laughs> an ad I posted. Um, it's just it's going fast, guys. And... Don't miss out. This is it. Especially after listening to this interview, it's going down and it's going to go down hard. And they're finding out that they gave open roads to Ethereum and block um, Ethereum and Bitcoin, and they turned away everyone else. And that's when the SEC started um, going after everyone with their lawsuits. They even went after Coinbase and. Then I came across this. Well, I learned about it last week. I said, nah. Coinbase is too set up. They have too much of a strong foundation. Foundation. They're not going anywhere. They're going to become a bank. I wish I could afford their, their stocks, but I can't. But I can afford the crypto. And that's what, I, that's what I've been doing. Um, and, and increasing my crypto portfolio position as much as I can and earning free crypto and letting the Algorand stake and just keep learning, just keep pushing forward because time's going to, it's going to, it seems like it's taking forever, but then one day we're just going to wake up and it's just going to happen. And all the studying and sitting down and reading and learning, I'll be ready for the future. And it, I feel it's the immediate future. This isn't years down the road. And I'm going to watch a lot of people struggle because they had no idea what was going on. And the value of the United States dollar just continues to de you know, lose value. And I'm going to be ready. I will become you know, a part of the next generation of millionaires, billionaires, slash crypto -nair. I'll see you in the next video clip. Visit the links in the description below. I hope you enjoyed the video. Have a good one, folks. Bye, guys.